Dun, dun, dun. Guys, what is going down? Welcome to a... Hey. It's definitely been a little while since I've done any vlogging, guys. I've been um, working on a few things. Come with me, guys. I'll show you what's up. This is now the kid in his bathroom. He owns the show. He's changed my life, guys. He's made me feel like... Like a parent or something. I just feel like a proud dad. It sounds cheesy, but guys, if you get... A kid and you'll know. My big boy, you're getting so big. What the What the fuck are you doing? Another news I've been working on this video podcast. I was gonna actually use this table here. I was gonna set up the podcast in here, but <laughs> what the fuck just <laughs> you should see the cat's not impressed. <laughs> Holy fuck guys, I, I like almost broke my neck. I was gonna set up my video podcast out here, but the audio, I don't know if you can hear, it's a bit echoey. I was like, yo, I'm gonna set this table up in the office. Then I went and bought another dining table. So that we've got a dining table, then we've got the exact same. Come with me. Dun, dun. This is gonna be the podcast setup. I've been spending a lot of money in here. Yeah, so I've got two Rode NT-USB mics. These are fucking actually really good. So looking at about 200 bucks each mic. This fucking thing, which will allow me to live stream from a DSLR camera, which is that bad boy over there. That was like $200, believe it or not. We got the lightning bolt cable, that freaking thing, $70. Lucky I've already got the camera. If you were to buy like laptop, camera, like a Podcast setup can get pretty expensive. And then I spent like 300 bucks on a table, but we need a good table. And probably the most expensive thing that I've actually bought is the continuous battery source for this camera to be able to plug it into a wall. Guys, guess how much it costs? You end up spending $260 just to plug your fucking camera into the wall. Unbelievable, but it needs to be done. So yeah, this is pretty damn exciting, guys. I've been trying to set up a podcast I've been talking about it for like, I don't think I've publicly ever put it out there. I've been talking about it with friends of mine for probably at least a year now. And it's always been the thing like, I've just kind of put it off and not done it. Obviously I've been busy with other shit, but I feel like now I'm just at the right point where I really want to just do this. I need some artwork or something for the wall guys. So if anyone knows anything cool or if, you've, if you're an artist, maybe DM me on Instagram with a concept or something. Hey, 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 you will learn to love this. Cats are definitely not like dogs. Like, fuck. Oh, he's getting attacked by a fucking bird. Oh shit, this is awkward. This is a scary time. Where, where you going, bro? So guys, we just went to the grocery store, and what did we get, babe? We got him a little toy with interchangeable. Toys. He's, gonna go crazy. He's never had an actual toy before. Oh, he likes that. Try to lift it up, make him jump for it. Oh shit, he's actually, fuck yeah. Oh, he's this little savage ass. Oh, he's trying to run away with it. Yeah, yeah he, wants to, it. he wants to kill it. it. Funny guys, I felt like the last couple of weeks of having him, like, that something's kind of been missing in his temperament. And I'm like, nah, it's all good, like, we play with him because we use our fingers, but he has not never been like this, so I think he's going to start really, like, just feeling a bit more complete. I feel like he's been like la like missing something, but I, th I feel like this is definitely what's needed. No. Just body on the line and stuff. Like that. So guys, I guess a bit of an update on what's kind of been happening. So life right now for me has been it's actually been really um, different and nice. Like not vlogging at all for the last three weeks you guys know i got the prep nutrition video up i just want to say thanks to everyone who you know really backed me up with that whole situation it was pretty shit again i'm just so sorry to any of you guys who bought the stuff and had a bad experience with them it was just shocking for me to even get those messages from a few followers like i had four people message me in the end and they said that they pretty much got ripped off and i just couldn't even believe it yeah so basically these last few weeks i've just been really getting excited about this video podcast which i've been working on i want to stream it directly to youtube and then put it on like itunes spotify but i really want it to be a like more of a visual like youtube thing i've been watching a lot of podcasts personally like video podcasts so yeah these last few weeks have just been researching for the video podcast buying shit and also what i've been doing is a lot of building things i've got a really cool program which i've been working on i've been working with clients shout out to all my clients who i've been working with and yeah i've just actually been working on the 30-day program which if you guys like my deep motivational talks you guys will love this program i've been putting a lot of energy and effort into it i've kind of encapsulated every key principle which i've ever used in my life when i've really improved my situation and improved my mindset and gotten good results in anything whether it comes to getting a good physique coming out youtube vlogs doing a gym season drop you know anything that i do which i have seen success in in the past life man it's all just about mastering your mind if you can master your mental you're gonna win you've, you've won even even for me man like i've I find sometimes I love to be really busy, other times I love to just not be that busy and just be productive within my own kind of like 
realm of what I want to do of getting a set amount of something done each day which doesn't have like a, a massively scalable reward at the time basically what I've been doing in the last few weeks I've been getting back into my training pushing through a few injuries I've had a few injuries guys um, but I've been building this 30 day program at a pace that I'm enjoying it you know what I mean like I'm not just sitting down and working and trying to you know rush out this program I'm just actually sitting down getting in that right headspace and thinking how am I gonna make this program to be so amazing that it's really gonna change people's lives who fuck with me anyway some pretty deep chats I might start cooking this barbecue guys it's my birthday on Friday if anyone wants to buy me a birthday present just go buy some gym seeds on the website the sales have been pretty slow the last couple of weeks just because I haven't been putting out vlogs it's crazy how correlated me vlogging and putting out content is to you guys buying gym seeds so appreciate everyone who has been buying but if you haven't bro chuck some stuff on afterpay and get an order through guys I feel so good I'm, I'm actually like genuinely just really happy right now in my life Guys, I don't know what it is, but there's just something about having a barbecue and some music and a beer. It's just the absolute best and I'm just so happy right now. I hope this can inspire some of you to buy a barbecue. You guys might comment below and say that I'm getting drunk, but maybe you're right. But I can I can swear, man. There's no better feeling than having a fucking barbecue and like just cooking some dinner with a beer. And also I have to give a massive shout out to my mum for the barbecue for my birthday. Mum, I don't think you watch my vlogs. I really appreciate this. Holy shit, the cat's going crazy. Holy fucking shit. He's actually, he's like a different cat with these toys, man. <laughs> he really wants to come outside onto the balcony. <laughs> Is he? Wanna come outside, big girl? <laughs> you wanna come outside? <laughs> hey. I don't like him going out there, though. I don't think he actually wants to go outside. I think he just wants pets. Okay, he definitely, oh okay, God. okay. So guys, what is going down? Another day, another dollar. Just here, sending some gym seeds orders. Actually, he didn't order this, but sending some stuff to Manu Vatuve. Manu, I don't know if you watch the vlogs, but um, I love you, man. Not in a gay way or anything, but <laughs> we gotta, we actually gotta go soon. Me and Jim are gonna go to the gym. Just in the DMs with him now. He says he'll be back from his injury. I told him to keep his head up, man. I can't even imagine. It's, it shouldn't have been injured, like as a casual real life person. If you're, if like sports and playing footy is your life and you're injured, like. Man, that would that would be so hard to deal with, but I guess it's just a part of it, isn't it? Anyway, I gotta send the stuff off. I'll see you guys in the next shot. We'll be at the gym, man. I haven't been in the gym with the camera in quite some time, so see you there. The hair is in a big boy. What are you gonna cook it on? In this. So it's actually been a few days since that last shot. I had a really good weekend for my birthday. Uh, my, a few friends were over from New Zealand and ended up just like going out Saturday night with this one and then all of them, and it was just it was such a good time. How's the fabric softener? Guys, Jim asked me oh. to get fabric softener. Let me She's like, get the one that smells good. I could have done better. Oh, as I said, the blue one's good, but you didn't smell it. I'm vlogging, are you spoiling? I'm cooking okay. dinner! Fine. Fine. It's fucking late! I'm cooking dinner, I'm boiling the water to put in the chicken. Fuck you, make your own dinner. <laughs> How dare you? I'm fucking cooking dinner. Fuck you. I'm washing all day. Guys, um, Jim got a tax return back and bought us a new washing machine. I basically bought myself a new washing machine. Yeah, if we ever break up, you can keep that. Good to know. So guys, this is what we are having for dinner tonight. Looks good, we got some carrots and stuff. Ugh. You know when the fridge just catches and it's like really heavy? Like you can't open it? Guys, look what I have for lunch, like kangaroo steaks. We actually eat kangaroo here in Australia. Even though I'm from New Zealand, but I live in Australia. I think new, new viewers would probably think I'm Australian, eh? Yeah. Kangaroo, it's actually fucking delicious. I had it on the barbecue today. It's like a garlic herb marinade. So damn good. And the leanest meat ever. Per 100 grams, 20 gram protein, 1 gram of fat, and 1 gram of carb. And that's only from the marinade. So it's like the leanest meat out. 
Wait, 20 grams of protein? That's, that's like way less than chicken though. So you gotta eat more to eat your protein up, but it's way leaner in terms of the fat being way lower. With my training currently, like I said, I've just been coming back from the injuries. I was bulking up until then. I just started saying like, fuck it, I wanna get fit and, and lean now. I was like, you're always like, you know, when you're bulking, you're like, oh, I'm not big enough to shred and like, you just keep telling yourself that, but I'm like, fuck it. Like, I'm, I'm just happy with like how I look and my size and I just wanna get fit and feel good. So um, I've been doing a lot of rowing machine lately and also been doing like circuit training and a lot of that stuff and then just lifting maybe like four times a week in between just doing cardio more so fitness not like incline walks on the treadmill for ages which i normally do to get lean but like i'm actually just trying to get fit there's a big difference between being fit and walking on the treadmill for an hour all right let's have a little physique check here just that kind of standard physique pretty much at the moment of like just someone who trains and doesn't like overeat but we'll still like i've been eating a little bit of shit at night uh, but just making sure my training's like really good and getting like a lot of meat in and, and eggs at the moment as well with, with a lot of carbs I've really been trying to have like rice and, to and bread as well as I took him for a walk today He's getting a lot better. You did very good today boy. I'm very proud of you <laughs> My little son. So here's how the physique's currently looking To that point with my physique, I'm just like I'm not Super happy with it, but I'm not like unhappy with it. You know what I mean? I think I might end the vlog here I know it's been a lot of talking, but I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in like a month Make sure you thumbs it up if you enjoyed it And I think me and Jim are gonna do our first ever podcast on Sunday night Are you, are you working Sunday? Eh? I'm only working till 6 But you, I mean, how are you gonna feel after probably that? probably not good. It's an 8 to 6 Fuck's sake, okay, I might, have to, I might have to do it by myself guys, episode one. I'm gonna stream it live to YouTube, so um, we'll have the chat on and everything. So if you wanna come tune in Sunday night, probably like 7.30 p.m. Queensland time, uh, we'll, be, we'll be doing it. So if you got me on Instagram, you'll see. So I look forward to seeing you guys then. First ever podcast. I don't know what, it, what we're gonna talk about, I don't know what it's gonna be about, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna have some fun. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace out, and I hope you've all had a good month of July. Little Halo. See, I wanna call them Walker, baby. Most people I talk to, they're like, yeah, no, I call them Halo. And that's making me wanna call them Walker more. But it was 50 50 on my Instagram. Either so. way, it doesn't matter because we're not fucking calling him Walker. Like, it's not. Well, happening. you can call him Halo and I'll call him Walker. How about that? Well, he doesn't actually know his name. It's not like a dog where you just like, they know the names. You said you're big boy. Guys, I seriously annoy the shit out of him. He's just, he just tries to like lie down all the time and I'm just always like manhandling him. You love it though, don't you? It's his parent, his parent. Hey, in the vlogs is so lame. Hey, freeze fam. Peace out. Hope you have a good weekend. I'll see you in the next one. Thumbs up and like and comment and subscribe.